You have to play play at the same time. Like, same show, eh? Same, same show. show eh? Yeah, then if oh I'm gonna okay, okay, pause get up. I'm Mei Gui. Hey, I'm Jeff. Hello, I'm Jenny. We're from BS 933. Da Da Ichi Lai! The Da Da Show! We're here to read about some assumptions about us. Mm -hmm. The era of radio and DJs are dying. That's why they are called presenters instead of radio DJs. So last time, 20 years ago, you all called radio DJs? Huh? Is it? Or what? I don't know. But you see our titles are always... Presenter. Producer, Producer presenters. presenter. All along lah. Yeah. Uh, and because I feel that, I mean, being presenters, it gives us a little bit more room to do more things. Mm. We're not just radio presenters, we can present anything. No one really calls us radio DJ. I mean, maybe Chinese will lah. Hey, DJ, DJ. When we say we are DJ, they say, oh yeah, the dumps, dumps. Uh. But I think it, it, we should answer a little bit more about this. The, the dying era part. of radio is yeah. dying. What are you talking? I think Jeff has a lot to say. <laughs> okay, uh, the next one hour. Uh, are you ready? Let's go. We are going to a new era of radio. So it's not really that radio is dying. We're transforming. Like. Correct. It's a little bit different. And as we embark on the journey into the new media. I think Jeff has a lot to say. Uh, the next one hour. Uh, are you ready? Let's go. Also on TV, we also win TV awards. <laughs> Because radio DJs are also like artists lah. So I think it's a different era for radio. Correct? Say. Yeah, correct. Well say. <laughs> Next. <gasps> Mei Gui and Jeff are actually secretly jealous of Chen Ning because wow. she is more popular and chill. Yeah, I mean we don't I don't do such comparisons. But people always compare ma. Who more chill? But I feel like we we are very different people, you know, from our height <laughs> to our personality to the kind of things we do in our life. So I won't put us on a on on a comparison kind of thing. Mm. Yeah. And in fact actually this is what I realized lah. There are one group of people who thinks that she's chiller. One group of people that think that she's chill. So it depends on what kind of taste you have. Yeah. Oh? Yeah. Next. <laughs> hey, you have an answer. Me ah. She's very popular. More popular than you jealous. No la, wait, answer the first uh, the other question first. They are chill in their 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 ways lah. Yeah. You see like Why it, she still want to jump back to that question no, no, no. to Sabo himself, I right? Know, I the kind of lady that Jeff likes, right? Actually I think Chenning portrays more of that. Right. Tall, long hair. Since the Daka Trio are very loud and talkative, people around them often find it hard to get some peace. We should rephrase this question. Yes. Since Jeff is very <laughs> loud and talkative, people around them often find it hard to get some peace. He cannot, he cannot do yeah, like Me and Chenning, we can don't talk. And we feel fine. The moment I woke up from my sleep on a plane, I. I I heard Jeff's voice and he said very far away from Very me. far away. He's really very loud. Eh? I don't like like silence, so I will try to make the entire you know, space not so awkward. And that's what I do. There's beauty in silence too. I, so I think you need to learn that. Let's <laughs> stay silent for 10 seconds. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Can you hear? See? He's <laughs> still yes, up. He's still the gas. Hello. Most, most of us are introverts. Actually, Including me. He is as well. Surprise, surprise. Mm. But a lot of us are actually off air, very quiet. Having travelled together, the Daka Trio have pet peeves about each other. Jeff, he really sometimes doesn't give people personal space. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he likes to do everything together. <laughs> it's to a very crazy extent. One instance, uh, for example, if you're watching, you know, on a plane, on, on uh, uh, in-flight entertainment, right? Mm. You have to play play at the same time. Like, same show, eh? Same, same show. show eh? Yeah, then if, oh, I'm going to talk about, okay, okay, pause, get up. So that we can laugh together. You know, when that, that punchline comes out, we are both, <laughs> how's your, how's your, quite funny. Ah. If not, you know, this side already laughed, eh? then I laugh. Like, what's the point? We should be watching together. The thing about having your own screen, <laughs> it means you should yeah. be on your own time on time. You're watching the same thing. But you all want more personal space la. Keep, keep, keep. Yeah. See. Okay. Uh, as the oldest? <laughs> <laughs> Why would a question like that? As the oldest, Jeff is constantly trying to keep up with the two co-DJ's energy. I disagree. Actually, I disagree. I, I think he's the most energetic, in fact. I think because he doesn't really need a lot of sleep. 
but it's his personality. Yeah, sometimes when we feel tired, actually he's the most energetic one. But when people see us coming up together as uh, the Taka Show, people will think that we are the same age. Same age. Yeah, it's such a lie. <laughs> <laughs> they, they think that, you know, we are like just two years apart, three years apart. Mm. Hello, we're ten years apart. You're ten years eh. <laughs> twenty lah, twenty old men here. Oh, twenty. <laughs> see, I wear like that, very trendy lah, right? Huh? There's still a difference. Like the things that I like, or maybe the things that I eat, sometimes they don't eat, ma, right? Yes, yes, yes. Jian tui, you eat jian tui, no? I honestly don't even want, know what jian tui. Hu tie, hu tie. The Taka Show Trail gives each other morning wake up calls daily. No. no. <laughs> Where all these assumptions come from? One? It's too romantic for us to do that. <laughs> <laughs> we set our own morning calls, yeah. we do not call each other. Yeah. Morning ah, for morning, it's me. I, I think cause, I mean, okay, they drive very fast lah. <laughs> drive very fast. What time do I usually wake up? Actually, I start snoozing from 4.30. Oh. You see, she got it all wrong. Snoozing is bad. <laughs> I know lah, I know. Snooze. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can feel that there is a romantic sexual tension in the <laughs> station among the Da Ka DJs. Huh? Your radar feel it. You can feel it. They can see. They can feel. <laughs> I actually enjoy to have such discussions and assumptions. It's more fun, why, right? If not, like people will feel like okay, the three of them are just like colleagues. So if people feel like hey, there must be something going on. Hey, they look like very good chemistry. Huh? I think it's nice, right? No meh? I think the time also plays a part la, because we have been hosting together for four years now. It's on a daily basis, ma. we see each other. Sometimes we see each other more than we see our friends. Yeah, or our parents yeah. even. To better appeal to their morning listeners, the trio need to hype themselves up to sustain their bright personality image. It's really bringing out the more cheerful and bright personality of yourself, especially during the morning show. I mean, who wants to wake up and listen to a boring program? So it's really like a... It's like a personality that we play. So sometimes if you hear us, we may not be our real self. <laughs> right? I agree. disagree. I disagree because I feel like whatever you portray, right, has some part of you in it. Mm. Yeah, so I feel like it may not be 100% you because that's not you mm. all the time, mm. but there's still you in it. I think we're quite fake. La. <laughs> <laughs> like initially, like before around six, this is us. Like, then the moment we're on, Hey, yeah, yeah. Once you know the, the 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 mic is on, I think we become a different person, like maybe elevated. Yeah, when I first joined the industry, I, I thought that wow, this this person not DJ, is an actor lah. But I realized that this is part of the profession lah. Yeah, it's being professional. Oh yeah, Mei Kui's question. <laughs> Mei Kui must be singing all the time at the radio station, and the other two are sick of it. Not really. Yeah, not really. <laughs> Wait! She's quite a good feeler. La. Feeler? That means uh, during shows, uh, where nothing is happening, really, the GOH is not here yet. We say, Mei Kui, sing a song! <laughs> Ding! Oh! oh. No hey. more! Wait. He wants to answer 10 fun, more questions. Maybe you should have an episode where it's all about yeah. quite fun, eh? assumptions no about more Thank you for watching this episode of Assumptions About Us. If you like the video, please like, share and subscribe. Alright, and don't forget to tune in to Years 93, the Taka Show every Monday to Friday, 6am to 10am. Bye! Bye.